Hi. I know I just made a McCarthy here. I know I just made a video earlier with my uh, brother, but I had to make a video as my reaction to the movie Little Favor. <sighs> it was a it, it's a it's a short on iTunes, but in a car is in it. And I uh, I bought it for three dollars, right? And it took me about two hours, well not even like an hour to be able to, I'm sorry, I got to plug in my laptop, to uh, be able to watch it after I bought it, because I had to like download and whatnot, and oh my gosh, oh, if you haven't seen the movie yet, I would say watch it, find a way to watch it, I tried to look online, but there, it wasn't online, it's only on iTunes, but if you have seen it, the way it ended, it like left one of the worst cliffhangers of movie history, it's, it's a 22 minute movie, but oh my god, what the hell happened? Like, if you watched it, you know what I'm talking about. It's... Lila? What? And James and, 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 and Wallace is just like, what the hell? It's like, why? And this is what happens as a cummer bitch, one of the dilemmas that I have to face. Movies that either make me emotionally scarred, or make me mentally just what the hell? It's it's. I don't know how to explain it. And then yesterday was it yesterday or was it the day before? I don't. Oh no, it was like two days ago. So I, I consider myself a cummer bitch, and I'm a fan of Benedict, and you know I love pretty much every movie that he's been in. He's an amazing actor. I watched Forty Something. And a few days before that, I watched Third Star, and, uh, in... I forgot the name of the movie. How do you forget the name of the movie? Um, Atonement. Atonement and Third Star. Atonement was a good movie besides the fact that Benedict's character kind of raped someone. But it was a good movie besides that, like, the actual storyline, because he wasn't the main character, but the story was, um, the movie was good. And then Third Star... He, in that movie, he played someone with cancer, and he had all these pain and stuff, but he did a really good job, and he wound up dying in the end, spoiler alert, he wound up dying in the end, and I cried like a bitch, like the bitch that I am, because I cry over everything, seriously, but, uh, the struggle, oh, and if, okay, so, for you something, I've finished every episode, I think it took me like two days, three days, and there's six episodes, in that show, the struggle. It, it has Hugh Laurie, Peter Capaldi, Benedict Cumberbatch, and a bunch of other actors I can't think of off the top of my head right now, but just those three. And it's really good. It's six episodes, but it's really, really good. Um, I think it's officially my favorite movie, I mean my favorite show. So, I was going to make a different vlog, but I had to respond to that. Oh, do you see my poster? I put up a new Beatles poster. Yeah, it's a, it looks so weird, because it's behind me. But, uh, yeah, I just wanted to go and kind of vent about that movie, Little Favor. If you haven't seen it, you have to go see it. You have to, you have to, have to, have to find it. It's on iTunes. It's only $3. Um, it was, it was a good movie, but it was kind of like, what? Honestly, excuse my language, but it was honestly a what the fuck just happened kind of movie. And it kind of just like... Ended like when you're waiting for an explanation, and then it goes to the credits, and you're just like, why, why? But it it was worth the three dollars that I spent on it. Um, I guess that's it. Yeah, that's it. I think this is my eleventh or twelfth vlog. I could be wrong. I'm not sure, but it's one of my vlogs. It's one of my. So, go watch, well, actually, I'm in the process of watching every single Benedict Cumberbatch movie that I can, which is, I'm going down the list, like, his filmography. So, watch Atonement, Third Star, 40-something, which is on YouTube, all six episodes, and Little Favor, if you can. Atonement and, um, crap, uh, fudge. And the other one, Third Star, they're both online. And if you guys can't find links, I have links. 
and I, I will gladly email them. I will leave my in, email in the link, and if you guys want, pretty much I have been able to find so far, let me see, how many Benedict movies have I watched? I have been able to watch 17 Benedict Cumberbatch movies, and I think I found 15 out of those 17 online, or uh, I think two of them, or two or three of them are on Netflix. But, um, yeah, so, if you really want, like, I could pretty much find any movie. I mean, even if it's not better than kind of much movie, it could be f some, from some, anyone, really. If it's a movie on, I'll find, I'll probably be able to find it online. If it's a short, I'll probably be able to find it. Um, if you need help finding a movie, most of them are put locker, so I'll probably find them. Just email me. I'll put my email in the bio. Again, I will put it in the bio. <coughs> Oh, and I have a link for David Tennant movies. I don't know if anyone is a David Tennant fan. I have Benedict Cumberbatch links. I have links for The Hobbit and The Desolation of Smog. Well, The Hobbit, The um, and the Expect Journey, and The Desolation of Smog. I have links for The Man of Steel. I have links. Actually, let's see what links I have for exactly. Um, I have an Unexpected Journey, Desolation of Smog, Hard Day's Night, which is a Beatles movie, which is on YouTube, Tinker Taylor Spy, Jack S D point five, The World's End, which is with um Simon Pegg, Martin Freeman, and I wanna say Martin Sheen, but I could be wrong. And the other Bowling Girl and Man of Steel and the other Bowling Girl. The other Bowling Girl has um Eric Banna, uh Natalie Portman, Scarlett Johansson, Ben and the Badge, Jim Sturgis, and a bunch of other people that can't Think of what's on my head. My head, like, if you guys watch for sure, like, you know what I'm talking about. My Mind Palace is literally just names of actors and and singers and and some actresses, but mostly just guys in my head. Don't judge me. I'm a hormonal teenage girl who likes who happens to like older guys. It's horrible. Like, it's it's a horrible like. I don't even know what it is. I'm, it's just, I like older guys. I mean, just look at them. See, this one would be, I think, 72 now, because he's 71. And then Ringo is like 74, 73. And then George would be like 6, 70? 69, 70? So, yeah. And Paul is my baby, and he's 71 now. Oh, well. So, I'm going to end this, because it, it's getting wrong. But, remember, email me if you guys want links to any movie. I'll find them. I'll make it my goal. Um, and, um, um, I will see you guys maybe tomorrow if I don't have school, because I don't have school today because of snow. So, bye. I'll make a, a vlog about my favorite YouTubers, because I was going to do that. So, we'll cut that out. Bye.